lid margins, we have meibomian glands. They're located both on our upper lid margin and lower lid margin. And these meibomian glands are responsible for secreting meibom, which is the oil layer of your tear film. This is the outermost layer of your tears and it helps to protect your tears from evaporating. But if some of these meibomian glands are clogged or blocked, it prevents that oil from coming out. So now there's no protective cover layer over your tears, so your tears evaporate too quickly, resulting for you to get symptoms of dry eyes. So this is where the heat and warm compresses come in. So the goal is to apply heat to your oil glands to allow them to become more unclogged, and then it's important to then massage to express the oil to come out so that it can be on the front surface of your eye. So the warm compress that I typically recommend to my patients is to get a specific eye mask for dry eyes. So typically I would recommend an eye mask called a brooder mask, or you can get any sort of generic equivalent to that, where you would place the mask into the microwave for about 10 to 15 seconds, and then you'd hold it over your eyes for about eight to 10 minutes. However, if you don't have a microwave, there's also various other eye masks that you can use. There's electrical eye masks, there's also eye masks that you have gel pads that you can boil up the gel and then place it into the mask and then hold it over your eyes. The reason why I love the eye mask is because it's the easiest option and it provides consistent heat for the period that you're supposed to hold it over your eyes and it also provides some sort of moisture. So after eight to 10 minutes, or however long your eye doctor recommends for your case, then it's really important to now express the oil out of the oil glands once the oil glands are now a little bit more melted. So it's important to massage both your upper lid margin, so when you look down and then you roll, you would look down and then roll um, to allow that oil to come out. And then for your lower lid margin, you look up and then you roll and massage upward to the base of your lid margin to really force that oil to come out. It's important though when you are doing your warm compresses to make sure that they're not hot because the skin around your eyelids, it's very sensitive, it's a very thin layer, so we don't want you to get any sort of burns. Also, it's important to really be compliant with these warm compresses because if you don't do this, then your glands are just gonna go back to being clogged up again. However, if you're finding that it's really hard for you to be compliant, or if you are compliant but um, you're still not getting the relief that you would like, it's important to talk to your eye doctor to figure out various other treatment options for your dry eyes and possibly some also in-office procedures that we can do to really help to heat up and express your oil glands. 